Hi guys, so in this video I'm going to be reviewing the Hakuhodo brush number S104. So this is a, a powder brush, this is what it looks like next to my face, and this is how big it looks like next to the MAC 150 brush. So it's, it's round all the way around, I'm turning it here for you, as the MAC one is a little bit round and flat. So it's flat when you turn it to the side. So the Hakuhodo one is quite dense, um, and it's round all the way around. So this brush is a member of Hakuhodo's flagship series, the Beverly Hill series. So this is kind of their very luxury, very expensive, pricey series. Uh, it has a vermilion orange colored handle, which is very, very lovely, and uh, a 24 karat gold plated ferrule. Not joking. <laughs> So it's a 24 karat gold plated ferrule which is completely, I guess, unnecessary but very luxury and beautiful and um, it's all handmade and it says right here Beverly Hills and it's hand painted and then um, the tip is hand painted with black and then they, uh, I think they use a decal to put this little, um, this little it says Mizaku, I can't, I can't remember what that means on it, I'm not sure if that's the name of the place that they are made or the name of the wife. I think um, the owner of Hakuhodo uh, designed these and had them made for his wife, I believe. Uh, I believe I heard that on a review on YouTube. Um, but anyway, so this brush, it's made of goat hair and it's just incredibly soft. I mean, it's like the softest probably goat hair brush I've ever felt. Um, and it's not the softest brush that I felt, but it's the softest softest goat hair brush that I've ever felt. There are softer um, types of fur hair, um, but this one is just very, very, you, you use it and it just feels so luxurious and it's it's absolutely wonderful. And it's, it's not super, super soft where it's not going to be able to apply your powder. Um, I find that the softer it is, the more it kind of leaves a powdery veil on your face a little bit uh, if you use too much product on your brush. Um, this one will distribute your product very, very well. Um, it's not going to leave too much of powderiness or anything like that because of being too soft. Uh, so this brush is quite expensive. It retails on their website for $94, I believe. Yes, $94, which that's a lot for a brush, and it sounds like a lot, and it is a lot. Um, but, you know, when you do compare it to other things, if, I mean, theoretically, if you're not a makeup artist who has tons and tons of brushes, if you just wanted, you know, like a powder brush, a blush brush, and then a couple of eyeshadow brushes, um, you would you would use this every day probably for your powder. And if you did, you know, compare that to like a really high quality straightener or a really high quality uh, blow dryer, you know, a really high quality hair dryer can cost $200 and a lot of people will buy that and not think too much of it. Uh, or, you know, really high quality straightener, $150 and you use that every day and you won't think that much of it. So, I mean, this could easily last probably longer as long as you take care of it really well, uh, longer than a straightener. I mean, you know, some straighteners can last a really long time, but sometimes they randomly break and after a couple of years of use, then you have to pay another $150. So, um, you know, it's just a very luxury item. If you have the money for it, you won't be disappointed. It's just, it's beautiful. It's so soft and it's so luxurious to use. So, um, and also it's just made with very good quality. I don't know if you can tell mine is filthy like it's it's very very dirty it's time for a washing but when this came new it's just you don't see a single hair out of place even though I have been using it so it's a little bit you know splayed like on the edges a little bit that's that's my fault um, if I had washed this and used a brush guard it would look absolutely perfect um, it's just really 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 beautiful so um, that's the S104 brush from the Beverly Hills series. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.